This is an updated video of how to install Google Maps on your Mac. The first thing you want to do is launch into Chrome and head over to Google Maps. So I'm just going to log in and head over to Google Maps here and then go ahead and open up Google Maps. From here, you want to select in the top right hand corner next to your profile photo, you want to select on the three ellipses or even faster, if you have this little download symbol, select on that guy here where it says install Google Maps. If you don't have this little button here, you want to select on the ellipses, scroll all the way down to where it says save and share. Then you have the option here second from the top to uh, install Google Maps. We're going to select on this. A dialog box is going to pop up saying install app and then simply select on install. From here, Google Maps is going to pop up as its own application where you can right click and dock it to your taskbar if you wanted to. Um, so you can right click and go keep in dock, open it, login, show in, find, in finder, all that sort of stuff. If you open up your launch pad, you also see Google Maps is the last application that was installed on your Mac. And of course, if you want to go ahead and uninstall it, you actually won't find it in your application section. You'll find it in somewhere called Chrome Apps. To get to Chrome Apps, the fastest way is launching in your spotlight search, which is the command plus spacebar key, and then typing in Chrome Apps. From here, you have a folder called Chrome Apps, and this will show you all the Google Chrome applications you've installed. So you have Google Maps right here, right click on it, move to bin, and then that app will remove from your dock down the bottom. It will remove from your launch pad and you'll uninstall Google Maps. But it is that easy to install Google Maps on your Mac in this updated edition. Of course, if you like this video, let me know by giving a thumbs up. And if you're in a super chat to raise your computer, hit that subscribe button as well. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye. In the wild, where the trees sway, there's a fox bright and gay.